Hi, it's Corrine for Wild Orchid Crafts, and today I have a start to finish on this 12 by 12 layout. I use lots of gorgeous products from Wild Orchid Crafts. Um, part of my video at the very beginning became corrupted, therefore I don't have the very beginning of how this came together. So I thought I would pop on real quick and just explain it to you. Very simple. Um, I use this gorgeous paper pack from Heidi Swap American Crafts. I got this from Hobby Lobby quite a while ago and I just chose a few designs and cut some strips from a few of the pattern papers in this collection. Then I used a piece of 12 by 12 white cardstock to adhere them to. Here are some of the scraps of the actual papers that I cut out. So I simply just put them at a slight angle on my paper and adhered them down. This one I used for something else, which you'll, you'll see on the layout. And then even in between some of the patterns, I put a very thin strip of pattern paper to it as well. So it was as simple as that, adhering them down at a slight angle. Then once I was happy with it, I cut it down to about 10 by 10. And then I adhered it to an off-white piece of cardstock. 12 by 12 piece. I did also adhere this to a piece of chipboard and I like to use these little metal hangers and just put a little E6000 on the back, adhere them down to the back of it, and then hang these in my craft room. So on this layout, I use this blessed. This is a font that I have. So I typed out the word blessed and cut that from the cameo. I will try and add the the um, name of this font in the description box. I also use this gorgeous wreath cutout from my Cameo. I'll make sure to add a link to that. And all the gorgeous products that you see here from Wild Orchid Crafts, I will have them linked in the description box. I used these pretty flory flowers. This one here is a, it's considered um, a Christmas flower, but as you can see, it looks great on this layout. I use these all the time. I use some blue chrysanthemums that match this aqua blue in the pattern paper. I use this pretty flory flower here and here. I have a little bow tucked in here, some beautiful leaves. I have a foundation bloom from Waldorf Crafts folded over and tucked in there. I have some new, new um, pearls in the metal flower center here and here as well. These are new from Wild Orchid Crafts. I love using those. And then in the center of some of the leaves, I added, again, some of the pattern paper, and that's what you see here. I wanted this light yellow. So if you have any questions, please leave me a comment. I hope you stay tuned for the start to finish. And like I said, the only part that you don't see is me cutting out the strips of paper and adding them onto my my um, 12 by 12 off-white photo. Check the description box for all the information. Thanks so much for watching and I hope you stop by Wild Orchid Crafts for all their amazing products. Enjoy!